Welcome to the Geek Easy. Sit back, grab a libation of your choice, and relax, because it's time to do some geek stuff in the Geek Easy. <laughs> Welcome to the Geek Easy, fellow geeks. Grab a beverage of your choice. Because today, I will be reviewing Wraith of God. Written and drawn by Aaron Lopresti. This is a book that is, uh, oh, I can't remember what they call it. You know, you, you, sub, you back them, you know, and it is the second book that he has put out. The first one is Garbage Man. And then there was a little story in the back about some monster hunters. And then this one is about the character Wraith of God. Okay. And this one actually has a little backstory in the back with uh, uh, garbage, uh, garbage Man and the Monster Hunters. Okay. But Wraith of God is a character who hunts vampires. Not or not just vampires, but uh, monsters. He goes after evil in all its forms. So in this one, it starts out with a group of men around a campfire. And it turns out that they are a bunch of werewolves in human form. And Wraith of God shows up, gets into a fight with them. They turn into werewolves and... He kills three of them. And one of them manages to get away. So he has to go and try and find the fourth one. Because he needs to get rid of that car that that other person. Or the other werewolf. And so you have Wraith of God. You've got his female assistant who kind of backs him up on stuff. And they, he sort of knows where they're going. So there's this a town just a few days away, and the, the three days of the full moon are upcoming. And so you get to, there's this town. Uh, you have, this it starts out with this little girl. She's... Uh, comes up and she starts talking to the, the new sheriff. And, you know, she, she's trying to get to know him and uh, she asks about uh, oh, this new stage coming in. And then a uh, a she's asking about those, the stage coach comes in and there is a a fancy Asian that comes in, you know, meaning well dressed, a gambler and a working girl that came in to town. All right. And it turns out that the, one of these three people are going to be the other werewolf. So Wraith of God comes in and he's trying to figure out which one it is so he can go after him. And you, you you've got that little sort of investigation going on as to trying to figure out which one of those three is the other werewolf. And then you also find uh, out about his history. You find out about his female assistant's history, how they got together uh, while <coughs> he is investigating, trying to figure out who in the town is the werewolf. Because you've got the three new people that came into town. The gambler, 
the Asian guy, uh, the working girl, and then, then another guy who'd been in town for like three weeks that was living on the edge of town, or the new sheriff. Uh, it's really well, uh, well-crafted story. It doesn't really give anything away too early, you know. It's... It's got, you know, each person could be it, each person could not be it, because, you know, it's just, and so, it is paced just right, there's just, you know, enough doubt and hints on either side, it's, you know, who, who could it be, and uh, so it's very well-crafted in his writing, and it's, the art is also incredible. Aaron Lepresti does a very good job with the art, because he's an incredible artist. Uh, and he, he's, he's, his writing is very good. Uh, I am very glad this came out, and it also kind of sets up for the one that's coming out that's it should be arriving soon because this is uh, this set up for the next book which hold on let me get this open here which uh, is the night club And then there's also a good sort of connection between uh, to that. I mean, okay. So like here, here, here's the art, which is you know, look how wonderful, how great this art is here. I mean, it's just he does. A really cool job with the art. I mean, this is better than some of the stuff they put in the mainstream stuff. And he's worked for uh, for all the big ones. And here, that little the blonde right there is the uh, the assistant. Uh, So you, and this is just a, I do recommend this book because it, you don't have to have read Garbage Pail Man to, to know what's going on in this one. Uh, but I do recommend you get Garbage Pail Man. But this Wraith of God is fantastic. Get it. And then, you know, you'll probably also want to get the nightclub because there is a connection to that. And this is the, that's the one that's coming out now. It's just it, the campaign just closed out. And uh, so pick this book up, order it. Uh, I'm going to give it a 4.75 out of 5 just because it is such a wonderful book. And. Uh, let me know if you've read it, uh, what you think of it. Like, subscribe, and most of all, enjoy your books.